hello guys welcome to today's video in today's video i'm basically going to be comparing the white tooth comb and this popular ez brush so i'm just going to be you know verifying the hype about this ez brush so i've seen a couple of videos and tutorials making use of this ez brush for their natural 4c hairstyle and i stumbled upon this in the local market here in nigeria so a lot of videos i've watched they ordered the ass for maybe amazon or an online store but i got this in a local market where i stay okay i actually don't think there's any difference between this one i got here and the ones that are imported so if you guys see any difference just let me know but i don't think there's any difference it's just basically the same concept okay i like the brush the brush is flexible you know between this area and you know very durable okay this is my two weeks old hairdo you know i just most of my protective style is actually this style so i can wear my wigs on it okay so i'm just gonna take this down just the two edges it's actually my wash day but let me just compare this brush with this um white tooth comb before i go ahead with my wash day so i'm just gonna loosen the two edges of my hair i've actually loosened this part so let me just go ahead and loosen this i use the water and um, leave-in conditioner mixture as sort of detangler you know to make the loosening process easier and you know to just help so that my hair doesn't break as much because it has been in this state you know for two weeks so i would say it's not actually moist it's actually dry so i have to moisten it up you know to help with loosening the hair loosening the hair i'm just going to loosen these two sides so that we can compare the combs like i said before after loosening it i'm just going to run my fingers through while it's moist before i go in with either the brush excuse me with either the brush or the comb so now i'm done doing that let's go in first with the brush so this is the hair properly i've gone through to remove any knots and now i'm going in with the brush i would say i like the way the brush went through my hair smoothly and it kind of smoothing it all out okay i liked the way it glided through my hair but will i say it's not something that my white tooth comb would have done i don't think so my white tooth comb would has would have gone in the same way but let us compare let me see the feeling of this okay so this is the hair loss that i experienced from combing it so it didn't cut my hair anyhow look at this is just what came out of the hair mind you i've not combed this part of my hair before i just went through with my fingers so now let's compare what my white tooth comb will do this is my white tooth comb the same thing i ran my fingers through the hair okay so i'm just going to comb through from the bottom to the top of my hair the comb went through my hair also but comparing the boots i would say it was it didn't make my hair as smooth as the brush did i had to go in more than once or twice before i could actually get that feeling that i got when i used the comb all right so i'm just going to go ahead and you know put that up in a twist before i continue loosening up my hair I don't know if i actually did a good job at comparing these two items because i felt i feel like it just because i used a small portion of the hair so it might actually be a biased judgment but comparing the two from my experience with what i did here the brush actually made my hair smoother and this is the quantity of hair i also lost while combing it this was the hair that i actually shed using the white tooth comb it's actually very little also compared when compared to the um white to the brush all right so uh from this comparison i will say i prefer using the brush so that will be all for this video let me go ahead with my full wash video you can click the link up there to see the full video all right i love you all 